you ever wanted to see what the inside of a balancer looks like, we decided to pull ours apart to clean it. There's the electric motor with the balancing shaft. Uh, so power comes in back here. There's your switch. Uh, transformer to convert it down to, I'm assuming DC, it might be AC, I'm not entirely, no, it'd be AC. There's some startup capacitors down here. This is what controls whether the motor goes forward or backwards. Works kind of with the control circuit up here. And then the cool part is when this thing spins and it throws vibrations around, you've got two little sensors down here that are connected by shaft to the actual balancer. And as that moves back and forth, these pieces here, there's one on the other side too, they pick up the vibration. They can tell you what the dynamic balance of the wheel is as it spins around. It tells the position based on an encoder here. That's just any any rotary encoders going to be fairly similar, just like a TPS or something like that. Neat stuff. We, we were kind of wondering if there was like a dead cat buried back there in that bag. Turns out that's just a weight to help it stay a little more stable. Neat stuff.